to the arcade owners to stop it to have a look inside one for us. Just coming, he's going to unlock it. Gone for this one. Could have been any one of these machines. It's interesting to see what it looks like. Well. Like they look more complicated than what you give them credit for, <laughs> don't they? What are they like in comparison to modern ones? Um, the modern ones are electronic, so... Is there if, more if room inside them, or...? Well, basically, yeah. I'll show you one of them if you want. Yeah, it'd be interesting. Yeah, well, these are all... The uh, real mechanism's mechanical, but all these pay out. And the coin part of it's uh, electrical. Are these still complete and utterly random, though, unlike the modern electronic random, yes. ones? Yeah. yeah. Uh -huh. Algorithms and all of that nonsense, where this it is just the luck of the arm. Yeah. It is, yeah. There's the coin switch there, so, which releases the handle grip. If you look down there, the clock that runs the game. Spins for quite a while, doesn't it? Yeah. There's a set up a wheel if you stop the clock. Show the feature really that would be better. Yeah, the feature should have been <laughs> good. Yeah, let's press the button and try and stop it on the 10. <laughs> a very basic feature, but I suppose for its time it would have been quite exciting. Yeah. So, well, that's lovely. Yeah, well, let's have a look at the inside of a modern one then. Yeah, sure. And all these pretty well run on the same principle. How reliable are they compared to modern ones? Are these prone to jamming? The coin mix jam up all the time because yeah. there's two P's, but the mechanics. The actual real mechanism yeah. and the payout are pretty reliable. Yeah, go on, They were well, designed right. for use of casinos and they're pretty yeah. I mean, similar how old these are. I mean, how I'm, old is this? 65, 66. Oh, they're not as old as I thought they were going to go bad. I thought they'd be like 40s, 50s. So. No, not that. When I got this, it was a complete mess. I was, this is the only one I was stripped right down to. I yeah. What's the oldest machine here? Can I flash it back the other way? Yeah. What's Sorry. the oldest machine you've got here? That'd be the win and place bolt at the end of that. Interesting. And I watched the film just the other day with this uh, game in it, and they're trying to argue it's not a gambling thing, it's a game of skill. Mm. If you can just get that just right. The thing is, every time you win, it alters the tension on the spring. Oh, does it? Yeah. Oh, it's not how they argued it in the film. No, and the way these pins. I mean, those pins are really bouncing, so... Yeah. I mean, I used to, when I used to play as a kid, you, you can make sure the second or third place to spare, you can pretty well guarantee walking away with that. A few pence more and you start it. Yeah. I guarantee it's lost every time. Yeah, invariably it does. 
very nice looking machine though, isn't it? Yeah, that's about 19... I don't know the exact date, but it's sort of definitely 50. Yeah. It was old penny. Very nice. Shall we have a look inside the model one? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Take a pick one of these, all these. It's got a first one. And it's just comparison to what they're like inside. They do seem a lot more emptier. Yeah, they are. But then they are slightly bigger as well, I suppose. Yeah, could well, argue. There, there's a computer at the back. Yeah. Power supply. And the, I mean, the bar press ones are pretty well bulletproof. Yeah. So, uh, sort of tend to keep going forever. So what's the hanging wire for? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it might have been a conversion from another machine, so it might yeah. be. Yeah. Fair enough. Well, it could be to do with the... Um, Oh, that'll probably be from the note validator, which has been removed. Okay. That's, that's a good guess, anyway. Very interesting talking. Thank you, you know, for giving us some of your time. We appreciate right. that. Very kind of you to open the machines up. Right. I'm going to go and play a couple more, I think. Right. There we are, tubers. Very kind of the gentleman. If you like the content, give us a like. Don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Tea bag.